Hey kids, are you ready to embark on an interstellar adventure? Today we're going to explore one of the most fascinating planets in our solar system. Today we're taking a trip to a planet that's hot, mysterious and super cool, Venus. It's a place full of wonders and surprises. Buckle up space explorers because this is going to be one wild ride. Make sure your seatbelts are fastened tight. First things first, did you know Venus is the second planet from the sun? It's right there, shining brightly in the sky. It's right next door to Earth in our solar system, just a cosmic hop, skip and jump away. But unlike Earth, Venus is a little crazy. Its weather is wild and its surface is extreme. It's often called Earth's twin because it's almost the same size and made of similar stuff. But don't be fooled by appearances. But trust me, it's got its own personality. Let's talk temperatures. Venus is like a giant oven. Venus is the hottest planet in our solar system, with temperatures that can melt lead. Imagine how hot that must be. Imagine being in a pizza oven but way, way hotter. It's like standing next to a volcano all the time. Surface temperatures can reach up to 900 degrees Fahrenheit. That's hotter than any place on Earth. Whew! Talk about a scorcher! Next up, the atmosphere. Venus's atmosphere is something out of a sci-fi movie. Venus's atmosphere is super thick and full of clouds made of sulfuric acid. Yikes! It's like a toxic soup. These clouds trap heat, making it even hotter. It's like a giant greenhouse effect gone wild. Plus, if you tried to breathe there, well, you couldn't. The air is not like the fresh air we have on Earth. The air is mostly carbon dioxide and there's almost no oxygen. It's like trying to breathe on top of a mountain, but worse. Definitely not a place for a picnic. You'd need a super space suit just to survive. But here's something cool. Venus has volcanoes, and not just a few, but a lot of them. Lots and lots of them. Imagine rivers of lava flowing all around. Some scientists think there might be more volcanoes on Venus than any other planet in our solar system. It's like a volcanic wonderland. Imagine rivers of lava flowing all around. It's like a scene from a fantasy movie. It's like a giant fiery playground, but definitely not one you'd want to play in. And get this. Venus spins in the opposite direction to most planets. It's like it's doing its own thing. That means the sun rises in the west and sets in the east. Crazy, huh? It's like everything is backwards. Plus, a day on Venus from one sunrise to the next lasts about 117 Earth days. That's almost four months. Imagine having a day that long. Talk about a long day at school. You'd be in class forever. Now let's talk about Venus's bright and shiny nickname. It's often called the evening star or the morning star. It's often called the evening star or the morning star. Why? Because it's one of the brightest objects in the sky. Because it's one of the brightest objects in the sky. You can't miss it. You can see it just after sunset or just before sunrise. It's like a cosmic beacon. It's like Venus is saying, hey, look at me. I'm the star of the show. And here's a fun fact. Venus was named after the Roman goddess of love and beauty. Pretty fitting, right? It's a planet with a name as beautiful as its glow. Because even though it's a tough place, there's something beautiful about its mystery and glow. It's a planet that captures the imagination. So what do you think, space explorers? Isn't Venus a fascinating planet? It's full of surprises and wonders. Isn't Venus a fascinating planet? Next time you look up at the sky and see that bright spot, you'll know that's Venus. Next time you look up at the sky and see that bright spot, you'll know that's Venus. A planet full of mysteries waiting to be explored. Thanks for joining me on this cosmic journey. I hope you had as much fun as I did. Until next time, keep looking up and dreaming big. Bye. Remember, the universe is full of wonders just waiting for you to discover.